Mars. Oh, I see I've lost then. Brilliant. Ooh, that was good. Here we are, look, we're crazy golf. Mine was two. She's still being me. I've left the glasses but Diane hasn't stood on it. He's trying to get a better angle for the shot though. <laughs> what a savage. <laughs> Mangled. Perhaps leaving your gigs there. Yeah. Seriously, super shot. You may pass. I never did like the taste of humans. Yes, it's raining. Yes, I'm exhausted. Look at the rain. Horrible day. Going for a full day of teaching now. Love it. But you think, oh, how can life get better? Great gig last night. I actually managed to start reading the charts. Played all right. No big mistakes. Good fun. Lovely to see the guys again. How can I make my life even better? I'll tell you how. 26p muffins, baby. Cheers, co op. You made a fat man very happy. Hello, everyone. It's Monday. I didn't get a chance to record last night uh, because it was just pandemonium. I was really busy teaching. And then, as soon as I finished teaching, I just wanted to play a little bit and just practice. And uh, I recorded a little bit for the Instagram. You know how it is. Been a, been a lovely week other than my car breaking down car broke down on thursday and the parts didn't arrive and stuff luckily the mechanics that i use are amazing looked after me so i've managed to get it all sorted uh but it, i just had to wait so it's taken i had to lose a day of teaching at one of the schools and another day uh, thursday and friday i couldn't teach so that's why I, monday is usually my day off and that's why i'm in in today so uh, that's why I'm filming this. I've come to the studio after teaching at the school that I normally teach at. So I'm not going to have a day off this week until <coughs> Saturday. I haven't got any gigs this week. Um, but then after that, it's going to start going crazy. So you'll start to see a lot more gig vlogs. I see a lot more of me. Not gig vlogs, sorry. Uh, weekly vlogs, weekly escapades. Um, and I'm going to start putting a lot more of my playing on here as well. I just think it's a great place for me to share my actual playing. It's, I don't get to share it that often. Not some of the stuff that I'm messing about with, like my little wave drum and stuff like that. It's great, great fun to do little videos like that when I'm. That's what I'm playing in my own spare time for, for myself. So it's cool to put it out a little bit, I suppose, isn't it? So yeah, this week bit of a mouth. I've had to get on my push bike. Oh, watch out! Gonna pop a wheelie any second. <laughs> Look at him go. I've got a foot long subway in the bag to make up for it. <laughs> Which doesn't happen very often. Been doing wheelies, skidding, bunny hops, doing all that stuff on me uh, on my push bike. 
great fun. I actually enjoyed it, you know. I think, I'm saying this, this is definitely not going to happen, but I think there's a small chance when the weather picks up a bit, I might bike here and back. You know, when I rehearse, I rehearse in the mornings normally, I might start doing that. Because I actually it didn't feel that bad. I don't mind biking. I enjoyed it, actually. So, uh, could be a new me. Shredded. Um, <laughs> just realised that right before, I bought some muffins yesterday. They're gone. So, <laughs> talking about shredded. Uh, so, yeah, I just want to talk about the gig Saturday. It's great fun to be back with the guys. Such a small world. Um, I was reading some of the charts and they're written by the head of music at one of the schools I teach at, who's amazing. You know, he's a great musician himself and a great arranger and the arrangements were wicked. I had proper drum parts for those new songs. Uh, and it's a bit daunting because, you know, I haven't played with Backstage Brass. Probably the last time you I played with him was on one of the earlier vlogs. I don't know when that was. It was definitely a long time ago. Because uh, their drummer's are better now. He's back, back in the fold. Um, and I'm just, um, I'm just a deaf. I just fill in when they need me to. So I've got a few gigs coming up with them. Quite a few gigs with little lines coming up. You'll see the uh, weekly escapades going to start uh, coming out again now. Now that I'm a bit busy, I, I took the first three months of this year off. Was it three months? Yeah, three and a half months, whatever. It's always a quiet time. I just had the odd gig, but I thought I'm not going to film too much. And I've just been prepping for the uh, Red Giant album, really. That's what most of my focus and energy has been going on. Sorting all that out, doing the Kickstarter and things like that. So that's what's taken up a lot of my time at the start of this year. Um, but I do gig as a professional musician, I have to do gigs, so I thought we'd be a lot busier than we are, and we're not, so I'm going to be doing a lot of more function stuff until the album comes out, and then we'll see what happens. So I've had to refill my diary, basically, with uh, pretty much debt work. The bands that I work for have been kind enough to offer me, offer me jobs, and that's what I've got to do to pay the bills, so that's what I'm going to be doing. And it's always great for the people that I work for are all epic anyway. I don't do any rubbish gigs anymore. I just do gigs with great people that I really enjoy. So I'm in a really fortunate position that I can turn down stuff that I don't need to do. And um, yeah, really, really lucky actually. So everything's good. The gig was amazing, like I say. Uh, it's always daunting. Um, I don't know if I'm sure I've showed you in a previous video, their pad is like that thick full of songs and you don't know the set until you get there uh, and I've got another gig with them week on Friday I'll be the same thing different set list probably and uh, he'll send me the set list beforehand so I like to get comfortable with the tempos if I know them uh, this one I didn't I didn't know any of the songs before I turned up uh, what they were going to do sorry and then I'll just get the set I have a flick through the charts if there's any that I don't know the tempo of I uh, I tell one of the guys I don't know the tempo, I don't know what song it is. It's one funny story with one of the songs. Because I, I, they're quick between songs as well, so what the hardest part of this gig is flicking to the next song in time. It's all in alphabetical order. Uh, but for this gig in particular, they didn't have a set list. They were just calling out songs, <laughs> which is obviously even more stressful. If you can imagine, like, a pad that thick and they're just calling out songs and you just turn to it and you've got to be able to read it and play it. So like all them hours of practice are coming okay, aren't they? Um, and one of them, I read it as James Brown as the composer, but I didn't know the song. I started playing it and uh, the trombone player, Dean, said to me, it's swung. I went, oh, changed the drum beat, started swinging. And then I realized, I looked again and it didn't say James Brown. It was somebody completely different. I was thinking, I don't know this James Brown song, but I presumed it was a funky thing. <laughs> and it wasn't at all. So like that split second, like how fast it is between songs and stuff. Um, yeah, but it's great fun. They're such good players and it's always a real good laugh. Uh, so brilliant. Me, Pi as well. Does life get any better? So hopefully you'll see me uh, see me chatting a bit more. If you've got any questions for me, pop them in the comments. Give us a like, pal.
You know what I mean? Just click like. I've uh, I've neglected this channel so much. I was on the verge of being monetized, and now I'm nowhere near again. <laughs> so uh, I'm going to start picking up the videos and that. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see what happens. Well, thank you all for watching. Appreciate it. Oh, and I'm also going to be recording some videos for the Red Channel, Red Giant Channel. We've got our own YouTube channel now. So if you can go there, that'd be amazing. Red Giant Official on YouTube. Go there as well, because we'll be putting out loads of videos on there. It's going to be awesome. See you all soon.